ABC 7 I team has been digging into ransomware attacks and today the FBI and federal cybersecurity officials are sounding the alarm to a new form of ransomware. Thieves are now targeting hospital and medical device companies in the Bay Area, threatening to block access to it unless a ransom is paid. I team reporter Stephanie Sierra has a look at how the attacks are advancing. It's a scam that can lock you out of your computer. Threatening all your files have been encrypted, and unless you pay up, confidential information will be exposed. This is what's called ransomware. So I use the word um, criminal very deliberately here. These are criminal organizations, and they're not trustworthy. Federal investigators say the cyber fraud is advancing with a new variant called Zeppelin. It's a type of malware that criminals use to target businesses and large corporations. Right now, Zeppelin is been on top of mind because they like to target specifically healthcare sector companies. Zeppelin ransomware first surfaced in 2019, but is now growing, most recently detected in late June. Here's how it works. Investigators say scammers will spend weeks trying to hack into their victims' computer networks. In some cases, they'll find a glitch, use that to access your computer software and your personal data, and then use it to blackmail you. Or you'll get an email like this. The email, also known as a phishing attempt, will threaten victims that their company has been hacked. And if the ransom isn't paid, often through digital currency like Bitcoin, confidential files will be leaked. This is not something that you can pay your way out of. First, never pay the ransom. If you do, you're twice as likely to be hit with another cyber attack within six months. In fact, a recent survey showed that 80% of businesses that paid a ransomware were also hit against. Investigators say most of the criminal organizations are operating overseas, including Russia. Even some are traced to cyber espionage groups in China. So what can you do to protect yourself? Using two-factor authentication whenever you're logging into any of your devices or computer network. Plus, regularly update your software and ensure your data is backed up, accessible outside of your computer. All the newer variants of ransomware will try to find your backups and corrupt them. If you believe you've been a victim of this crime, you can file a report to StopRansomware.gov or to the FBI's Internet Crime Complaint Center at IC3.gov. Stephanie Sierra, ABC7 News.